Hi everyone, it's your girl Shanice. Welcome, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I hope you're hitting the subscribe button and also turning on your bell so you get notified every time I post new videos. It is that time of the month again. I will be going over the Healing to the Nations magazine. Now, I talk about this magazine because um, it's something that really promotes health and healthy living as well as the miraculous that we have in Christ. So I wanted us to do our proclamations, which are found on the very last page of this book. I highly recommend getting access to it. If you have a Christ embassy near you, um, you can get access to this Healing to the Nations magazine. We're going to do the faith proclamations. Remember, this is our month of prophecy. So the words that you say, especially when they're in line with the scriptures, they're going to work out for you and you're going to see them manifest in your life in this month of prophecy. So just go ahead and as always, you can say after me and just come back and say this. Every time you feel something off in your body, anytime you, you know, are feeling pain, whatever it is, come and say these proclamations and you see them. You'll see, you'll see what happens. You'll see the changes in your life. Say it as often as you can. And you'll see the changes in your life. So go ahead. And at the end, you can add whatever confirmations and whatever declarations you want to add. Remember, you can also apply these words to your finances and to every aspect of your life. So just say, I am a custodian of the higher life in Christ. Therefore, nothing contrary to that life can be found in me. I exude the glory and the beauty of Christ always. And my spirit, soul, and body manifest this grace. I live and enjoy eternal life, now and always. The word of God is my testimony. Its declarations are my meditations. Thus, I live in the reality of what God has said concerning my health. I am the one whom the Lord has made strong, energetic, and victorious. I am a manifestation of God's agenda of health for all. The environment in which I live is Christ. Here, there is no health scare, infection, or pandemic. No matter what happens to those in the world, I stand firm in faith and I enjoy my glorious life now. I bask in the provisions of Christ for my life, health, and all that concerns me. The Lord Almighty is my defense and fortress. Satan has nothing in me because I am full of the Holy Spirit at all times. I have a wholesome tongue. My words sculpt my life following God's perfect will. Therefore, I walk in divine health every day. My eyes of understanding are enlightened. I see the invincible and I am empowered to do the impossible. My life goes only in one direction, the direction of God's purpose. Therefore, I'll never be sick. I only grow from strength to strength, victory to victory. Amen. My origin is in God. I am born not of blood, the will of flesh, nor the will of man, but I am born of God. Therefore, I have overcome the world and its systems. The greater one lives in me in his fullness. I am full of life and vitality. I will never be sick. Dear Father, thank you for my victory over death and hell. Thank you for bringing me into life and immortality through your word. The law of the spirit of life in Christ Jesus works in me. I am a life-giving spirit. And I dispense life to everyone and everything around me. My life is a manifestation of the virtues and perfections of divinity. From the crown of my head to the soles of my feet, I am full of life and divine health. 
no sickness, disease, or infirmity can fasten itself to my body. I choose and live the good life of divine health, abundance, joy, strength, and vitality. I can never be disadvantaged because I am a child of the Most High God. I manifest the excellence of the spirit and the life of God in me is superior to the devil and his. My faith is the victory that overcomes every challenge to my health. My health shines for today and every day. I am a partaker of the divine nature and dwell in Zion. Therefore, I don't get sick. I am born for health, success, and the glory of God. Hallelujah. I am fearless, for death has been paralyzed and defeated by the Lord Jesus. And when he did it, I was in him. I boldly exercise my rights in Christ. I boldly exercise my divine rights in Christ, taming my body and environment with dominion. Nothing shall by any means hurt me. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Like I said, say these words, say them often, let them come into your spirit. Let them become your reality and you will see that your life will never be the same. Thank you all so much for sticking to, to the end. Like I said, this is your lifestyle now. You say these words about yourself. You say these words about your, your finances, about your family, about everything that concerns you. And you will see that it will actually happen because the world talks about manifestation, but we know what the true power is. Thank you again. I love you so much. Make sure you're tuned into the Rapathon with the man of God, Pastor Chris. I'll see you later on to talk more about that. Bye. God bless you.